what is a stream cipher in this video we will try to understand that we know that if a sender wants to send a sensitive message to a recipient so that no third party can read it then encryption is a solution the sender can encrypt the message using a secret key and send it across the recipient can use the same key or a different secret key to decrypt and read the message we also know that if the same secret key is used for both encryption and decryption the encryption process is known as symmetric key encryption and in public key encryption two different keys are used for encryption and decryption a stream cipher is a symmetric key cipher that uses the same secret key for encryption and decryption much like a block cipher but unlike a block cipher a stream cipher operates on each digit of the plain text to produce a digit of cipher text in other words each digit of plain text is combined with a digit of key stream to produce a digit of cipher text usually a digit is a bit and the combining operation is xor and the key stream is a pseudo random value that is generated from a random seed value the same random seed value is used to generate the key stream while decrypting the cipher text digits to summarize in a stream cipher we first generate a key stream from the secret symmetric key then each digit of the plain text is xored with each digit of key stream to produce a cipher text digit similarly at the time of decryption the key stream is generated from the same random seed value in a similar way and the generated key stream is xored with each cipher text digit to produce plain text digits there are two types of stream cipher synchronous stream cipher and asynchronous stream cipher or self synchronizing stream cipher in a synchronous stream cipher the key stream is generated independently of the plain text or the cipher text in other words a pseudo random number generator is seeded with the cipher key and the pseudo random number generator produces a key stream that is independent of the plain text or the cipher text in a self synchronizing stream cipher or asynchronous stream cipher the key stream depends on the cipher key as well as a fixed number of cipher text digits that have already been produced at the time of encryption or read at the time of decryption so where is a stream cipher used stream ciphers are often used in applications where the length of the plain text is not known in advance for example we cannot know how many bits will get transferred in advance in a secure wireless connection in those types of applications stream ciphers are often preferred because of their speed and simplicity of implementation in hardware also i hope this helps interested viewers who want to know more please refer to the book cryptography and public key infrastructure or visit the website of the security body the relevant links are provided in the description the security body also provides many cyber security courses the relevant links are provided in the description you can also subscribe to us and get notifications on recent videos